Prime Minister Mia Amor Motley says she's prepared to meet with farmers who are upset over increased water rates. She, however, cautions that while a case could be made for a debt forgiveness on the arrears owed for water, it was untenable to maintain agricultural water rates at the 66 cents per cubic meter within a water-scarce country. During the financial statement and budgetary proposals in March, it was announced that a fixed water rate of $1.80 per cubic meter across the agricultural sector would be introduced effective May 1st. While this was considered a big win for farmers who get water from the Barbados Water Authority at a commercial rate, it represented an increase of $1.20 for Bay DMC farmers. Motley, speaking during a press conference, said she's open to talks. They were paying 66 cents for a cubic meter, which is 66 cents for 220 gallons of water, and they've been paying that rate for 40 years, Clay. Um, I don't know that any other rate that you have been paying for 40 years that has not been adjusted at some point in time. But equally, the government remains willing to meet with them and to listen to them. Um, there may well be a case for us to forgive the debts, that may be true. But we cannot in today's world believe that one of the 15 most water scarce countries can continue to, to, to keep water rates at the same level that they were 40 years ago without reference to the fact that every price has increased upon us and without reference to the fact that the groundwater crisis that is upon us is also as a result of the climate crisis. We have to drink water as a country. We have to use water as a country. And if we want to do that, we have to make sure that water is first available. And if the cost of making it available is both one, to increase, augment the supply, and two, deal with the fact that we have something around 45 to 50 percent of what we call non-revenue water. What is that? Fancy language for the simple fact that for every gallon of water that you pump, or let me put it another way, for every 100 gallons of water that we pump, we're losing 45 to 50 gallons in the pipe in weeks. That's our reality. So I'm more than willing to sit with the farmers, as I'm sure the Minister of Agriculture will.